The most important interface between the breathing system and the patient's lungs is an airway management device. Airway management requires safe, effective and reliable equipment used to achieve two goals, provision of gas exchange, that is, delivery of oxygen to, and removal of carbon dioxide from the lungs, and protection of the lungs from aspiration injury. This requires safe, effective and reliable use of equipment alone or often in combination. The approaches to airway management in which equipment is used is usually in order of face mask ventilation using adjuncts. Supraglottic airway device use. Tracheal access above the vocal cords or endotracheal intubation, and tracheal access below the vocal cords which includes tracheostomy and cricothyroidotomy. These approaches may be used alone or in sequence. For example, a supraglottic airway can be used for intubation. The choice of equipment also depends on exact surgical and anesthetic circumstances, the anesthetist's experience and equipment availability. Other airway adjuncts like laryngoscope, forceps, bougies, stylets, and airway exchange catheters will also be discussed in this series. However, we won't go into detail on the management part of the airway. We will begin this series with a face mask next.